Um, today is um, May the 13th. It's been an interesting 10 days. I got to meet with the president of Trident Tech College. She's a very nice lady. Um, I'm fortunate to be graced with her hospitality. I explained to her that she has a superhero quality that makes everybody feel as if they're the only person on earth She's inspired me, but I'm still confused because I was denied access to try to tech college based upon what she said about the way I was dressed. I... I cannot. These, these are what works. This, this is what works at Trident Tech right here. This one right here. These two. They're the house blacks. Okay, they're the ones. They're the preferred blacks. They're the ones that get paid. They're the ones that get to deny me access to a campus of which I have contributed my three pounds of flesh. This is now the face of of the New World Order. And the, the order that is the black woman is over the black man. No impunity. Now, I don't have this outfit, but that's the way I like to dress right there. Everybody, some people know that I feel more comfortable in that outfit right there than this outfit right here. Then this outfit is the one that I believe no matter what I wear, there is a, I don't believe that's a, a African-American male or a black male, but as a photography student, some people can only see things the way they see it. There's no blame. Um, I think that <clears throat> I try to get examples of uh, what because I don't like to, I don't want to do all the talking here there's um, other very smart people and there's other opinions that um what what okay is raw and my daughter raw uh -huh. we're just going to touch on a little topic matter of fact this is a big fucking topic tonight and it's about jesus jesus <laughs> I want to say straight off the top, fuck Jesus, all right? Fuck that motherfucker, that white motherfucker got niggas still enslaved and still asleep. That book is a myth. You Bible-toting Negroes, 
going to church. I don't, uh, you know what? That's if that's what you want to do. That's fine. But don't be on my most, don't be on my daughter's page and don't be on my page talking about uh, verses quoting and verses and shit like that. Nobody want to read that shit. Matter of fact, I read the Bible three times in my lifetime. I'd rather read Cinderella. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I believe Cinderella happened and fucking Jesus dying on that sin. Yo, a white man, blue eyes, blonde hair, dying on that cross for sins today. Really? really? You really believe in that shit? Europeans oh, created that fucking book just, just like, like they created demonology. King James create, wrote demonology and created the Bible just to enslave your colored ass. Just to enslave you and keep you worshipping them. And that shit's been working for like 2,000 years plus because niggas are still talking about I mean Jesus. Oh, you want to help Jesus? Oh, God. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't forget about the preacher. Lord, bless the Lord, and pray the Jesus, the Holy Lord, to the bank. Well, you know, what they money, what they want to call tithes and shit like that. You giving your money straight up, just like that, and your ass is still broke. All right? Fuck Jesus. If he was supposed to come and save the goddamn world, why that motherfucker never came? Why you ain't come back yet? Why niggas are still dying on the streets of Boston, on the streets of fucking New York by cops and shit like that, on the streets of Detroit, okay? Why is niggas still dying left and right, you know what I mean, behind the hands of the slave massa? Because y'all niggas still praying to their fucking God. That don't make no sense. Oh, you know what? Believe it. Like, 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 like Ross said before. Believe in your motherfucking self. Believe in something that you can see. Something that you can touch that's tangible. For real. I was why are you think about that? Why are you believing in some fake ass motherfucker? You know what I mean? That's the most sick shit. What me and my daughter do is entertainment for your ass. That's why y'all motherfuckers keep watching. You know what I mean? Hold on, they say it's incest. Y'all want some incest? Give me some incest. Ow. <laughs> Damn. That's a no fucking incest. That's what you got. And if you want to know more about that motherfucking incest, let me tell you. Damn, you slobbed all in my mouth, chick. Some bookers got right in my mouth, too. Damn. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, do your motherfucking research when it comes to incest. Cause first of all, baby, I, I'm sure none of y'all motherfuckers read the bargain. Okay, too long. It needs to be a, like two sentences for niggas to read. And if you want to know the truth, put it in the book. A nigga never, nigga never know the truth. Okay. First of all, we come from. Our ancestors come from ancient Egypt, okay, uh -huh. where the pyramids are still uh, still standing over 3,000 years ago, probably longer than that. Yeah. Uh, do some research, niggas, okay? It's called royal inbreeding, all right? We've been doing this shit for the years. you needed to keep the blood in the fucking family. You know who else is? You know who else is doing it and who was fucking wealthy and owned 5% of the motherfucking earth? The royal fucking family in London because they know the signs behind keeping their blood pure. So why do you busy worried about me touching my mom's titties? Do your fucking research and get a better relationship with your mother. Just because your mother beat in her ass for you sucking on dicks, don't mean you can come over here and judge the motherfucker because me and my mother have a good relationship. And, 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 and your mother ain't kissing you in the mouth because she know you out there sucking all type of different dicks. You probably got more fucking herpes and little crabs in your ass. For real. And we suck you coming. You gonna call us a hoe, a talk to talk? Really? <laughs> really? Mama talk, daughter talk, they call baby talk. talk. They call us talk to talk, talk to listings, <laughs> talk to listings. Really? Talk to on. I really talk to talk. You know what? Guess what? I'm gonna be the prime thought. You know why? Because cucumbers are delicious and they're nuts. If you gonna let nut come, you gonna let a nigga nut on your face. If you like nut so much, let a cucumber nut. That shit has sodium. It has all type of nutrition for your ass. Exactly. And if you can believe a cucumber bust nuts, then nigga, you as dumb as the rest of the fucking enslaved world that believes in that motherfucking Jesus. That's 
coming back to save your ass. Oh, Jesus, I need you to pay my bills. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. I'm oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. I've been so good. I've been so good. Please send me a good man. <laughs> Jesus. Um, I didn't. I did not invent that. I did not. I've experienced it. I've experienced all of that crap. These modern, modern black women. They love them. I don't know why. Aunt Jemima, Mrs. Butterworth, they love, and especially at Trident Tech. Dr. Thornley is a beautiful lady. She's treating me with respect. But A large percentage of the employed people at Tri, as creative as I am, as studious as I am, as traveled as I am, not one person at Trident Tech has offered me a job. I got what I came there for. I didn't come to Trident Tech for a job. But these mammies. That Trident Tech is a going to be the next South Carolina State, apparently. They phased uh, South Carolina State out and I never drew a nexus as an outside observer because I don't go to Trident Tech. And I can't think of any other reason that I would ever put my foot back on the campus of Trident Tech. There's some very nice people led by Dr. Thornley. But those mammies over there, She's trying to tell me that if I wore the right outfit, that I would be more accepted or I'd be less likely not to be a denied access. I don't want to look like this. I don't want to wear this because no matter how, no matter how much I wear that right there, I'm not going to be a white man. This is what I like right here. This is what I like to look like. I like to look like this. And outfits like this. I think this is going to be my... I think I'm going to design this outfit, really, because this is what I want to look like. I don't care that she doesn't like with her outfit on. Nobody's going to deny her access. Aunt Jemima. I was advised not to use the F word, fornication under consent of king, fornication under consent of carnal knowledge. I was denied access to try to take campus. <laughs> and the only thing that offended some people was the fact that I used the F word. E. F F F F I N G. What the F E F F F I N G. I'm effing E F F I F F I N G. I'm effing amazed and I am utterly confused as to how it's fine. I'm going to just suggest, number one, don't believe me. Number two, don't believe anyone else. Number three, do your own research. Number four, make your own videos. And where there's one of these, one, there's no fun. Where there's two, you better run. And where there's three, I will not be. Good night.